I am sick and tired of this AI companies creating hype with their flashy demos but when it come to launch but Anthropic, an AI company with 0% hype and 100% dedication to compete OpenAI, just released artifact feature with their new model, Cloudy 3.5 Sonat. It gives you devil-like experience and it's really available as a feature preview. And you know what? Most of you have no idea about its potential uses beyond just real-time code generation. Artifacts isn't just about generating code in real time. It allows users to generate code and preview on the fly in a dedicated window right alongside their conversation. Remember the prompt, explain it like I am 5. You use it to understand any concept or topic. Don't say you never did. But now we have its upgrade. Create a React or JS application with animation and visual to explain whatever you want. Let me give you a real example. I wanted to understand the quick sort algorithm so I asked Cloud to create an interactive JS application with animation and visuals to explain the quick sort algorithm. Now what did I get? An interactive React component that visualizes quick sort the array represented as a series of bars with the heights proportional to their values. Now let's start the animation. The component animates the sorting process showing how elements are compared and swapped. It has color coding like gray for unsorted element, yellow for current pivot and so on. Let's make it a bit faster. Hmm, okay. How about skipping through full financial statement and just understanding them with an interactive BI report? So I asked Cloudy, create an interactive business intelligence infographic report for this Apple FY2024 Q1 report with the financial statement file. And it's done. Look at this. It's so elegant and informative. A chart is in its own card component with the title and chart itself. This dashboard is packed with key visualizations. It shows financial highlights like total net sales, cross margin, operating income and net income. Get this, total net sales are sky high at nearly 120 billion. It breaks the net sales by category where iPhone sales dominate at 58%. It shows net sales by segment where America's lady pack and it lays out the split between product and service sales. Look how the dashboard is responsive and interactive. However, chart elements and specific values pop up. Great design, really. Okay, but I, I didn't stop there. I wanted to understand a research paper through interactive visuals. So I challenged Cloudy create an interactive and detailed dashboard to present the learning from this research paper. Make it look really good and professional. At first, broke down the research paper into four tabs. Great. Let's go through overview. It has model performance, key innovations and did you know it relies entirely on self-attention mechanism without using older types of neural networks. Great. Isn't it? Quick forward to architecture tab. It gives a brief about transformer architecture and self-attention mechanism. Computing attention weights for all positions in a sequence. Okay, but still my mind is looking for the missing picture of how self-attention works in transformer architecture. Now move to the performance tab. It says transformer have really less training cost compared to their score. Hmm, the key insights contains advantages and future direction. Okay, let's make it better, more intuitive. So it gives a hands-on understanding of how attention mechanism work. Just increase the weights and the word get deeper. Mm, okay, just restart and focus on the diagram. Now we get a very very informative animation showing how data moves through a transformer model. It made me ask in more detail about each component of the architecture. Like more about encoder and decoders. So I have a detailed component descriptions. Just click on any component and learn more about its specific role in the model. Great. Now now let's give some final touches and we finally get the architecture combined with the description of its functionality. Yeah, it makes me understand a bit clear on encoders and decoders but yet not so satisfied and hit the time limit. But you know what, the possibilities doesn't end there. You can make 3 just animations of any physics concept that you find hard with theories or you can go along with creating games in real time based on any concept you want to learn. Basically, what I mean to say is using LLMs for 
teaching topics in such interactive and visually appealing ways will definitely enhance self taught experiences. Even professionals can create an entire React app or many micro tasks without any involvement in slicization or any programming skills at all. Now, you might not be very familiar with Cloudy compared to ChatGPT, but the current state is that Cloudy 3.5 Sonus benchmark score is higher than GPT 4.0, and I have seen how well it follows instructions and understand context in first hand. And the best part, you don't have to fight the model to get it to actually do as us. It's like Entropic must be promising $10,000 tips in the system prompt for it to perform so well. So, until GPT 5 reaches PhD level intelligence, see you in the next one.